Good morning, Renaissance Unity. Ah, what a blessing it is to gather with you here this morning as we continue our journey. Are you ready for this journey? Are you ready to continue your journey this week? If you are, let me hear you say yes. Amen. Amen. Today we are continuing our spiritual journey this second Sunday in Advent. And there is no better place to be for me but to be right here with you, shoulder to shoulder, as we begin our journey. So glad that you are here with us in this space and so grateful for those of you who are joining us by way of technology and Facebook. So this morning, our journey begins with peace. Reverend Glenn walked us into the, began our Advent journey with hope and faith. And so we add to it another mile marker on our soul journey to be in this place of peace. And when I think of peace, I'm just reminded of a couple of Bible verses and one that you'll probably hear from Reverend Glenn, but this one I was just moved to share with you that when the storms of life come along and we are those disciples in the boat and the water came and the wind came and the storms came and they were shaken and someone said, go, go wake them up. Go wake up Jesus, that Christ consciousness. And he came and said, what is the problem? Where is your faith? And he said to the waters and the winds, Peace, be still. And that's a consciousness for us that when life happens, when the storms and the rains come, we utter, we say, we pray. Grab back your peace and say, Peace, be still. God, be with me. Christ consciousness be in me. Take back your peace. So this morning we are going to open up with centering ourselves with this consciousness of peace. We are going to pray and take this labyrinth walk, this meditation walk of being in this place of peace. So will you join me now as we open our service? and the consciousness of peace. Just take a deep breath in and just gently release it. And as you do, go ahead and close your eyes. As we open our hearts and our minds to be present with peace, that no matter what occurred before this moment, whatever the storm was, we let go. We release and we come into this space to be in a place of peace. Dear Father, Mother, God, we are just so grateful for this day. We are grateful for the opportunity to be present here on this earth. To be the keepers of the peace. To allow the peace that is within us to permeate and to move out from us into this world. Dear God, we know that things may happen to us, around us, and through us. But what matters, what matters are the things that happen in us through you. And so we move into this day with the peace of your presence moving in and through us, feeling that energy moving through us, every cell in our body, calling us to be in this place of peace. What a powerful knowing that what we need, we can pull from the universe. And so we are so grateful. And as keepers of the peace, this morning we remember those in our community who may not be experiencing that peace. And so we lift them in prayer. 
we see the peace that they seek running towards them, comforting them. We lift in prayer this morning those who may be facing a physical challenge, a medical challenge. We see the peace and the presence and the energy moving in and through them, through every cell in their body. We affirm that truth, and we see that happening for them. And this morning, we lift in prayer those who have experienced the transition of a loved one. And dear God, we know that there is no place where you are not. And so we hold on and we allow your powerful presence, your love, and your energy to bring the peace the comfort that is needed. We lift our world in peace. We see every four corners of the world. Peace being the order of the day where there is discord. We see harmony and peace flowing in. And we think these words of a song. Let there be peace on earth. And let it begin with me. And so we move into this time of prayer and meditation in the silence as we walk our labyrinth of peace, seeing our mind's eye, the circle, the journey to peace. And as we see the candles of the Advent, we allow that present peace, the arrival of the peace, the arrival of the Christ consciousness to be that altar, to be that focus as we take our minds and we go into the silence to connect with the spirit, the peace that is within. I am centered in infinite peace. And as I bathe my mind in infinite peace, I know that no circumstances can disturb or distract me. The peace, inner peace, is my natural state. And I am centered in God, and I am a peaceful presence. Peace flows from that place in consciousness of God, and it fills my awareness. The peace of God refreshes me and goes on and moves through me. And as I, we continue this journey, this journey into peace, to that place, the rebirth or awakening of the Christ consciousness, we do so with a peaceful heart and a peaceful mind because of the peaceful presence of spirit that dwells within. We go forth this morning with a spirit of excitement, enthusiasm, and expectancy. And so it is. And so it shall be. We speak these words in truth in the name and in the nature of the indwelling Christ. Amen. And amen. 